So as we've been talking about pinpoint weather alert day, those road conditions, we are tracking. We have Jim Hooley out there on the roads. I believe you are on the south side of town now, right, Jim? Yeah, we're over in the south, southwest side of town on C-470. And i got to tell you, take a look at this. We just went by Kipling. We're coming up to Ken Carroll. Uh, it's not bad out here. Obviously, the road surface is just wet. The snow that came through here earlier, it may have stuck for a little while, but it's pretty much all melted off, all diminished right now with the volume of traffic. Traffic has been getting a little heavier now as we move through the morning hours and people start picking things up, getting up, getting away, and start making those moves out to travel to wherever they may have to go on a day like today. This day before Thanksgiving. Take a look at these pictures, though, earlier in the morning. I mean, up along I-70, as Drew was saying, I mean, the conditions up there are winter-like driving conditions. I mean, it was really coming down before the sun came down. One of those bands of snow moved through there at about 6 o'clock in the morning, and it just dropped a lot of snow on the roadway along by Chief Hosa. These are the eastbound lanes there by Chief Hosa and Evergreen. I mean, it was really coming down. No lane recognition whatsoever. That, for the most part, I can tell you from our last pass through there, that has cleared up. The plows have been out. They've been doing a great job. See that out there? knowing that the, the winter-like conditions are going to be existing here for the next couple of hours on I-70 and a lot of people will be traveling. They've had the blades out. They've cleared the roadways. And for the most part, the roadways up in the high country are not too bad. Again, as you get a little higher near the tunnel, it's a little different story at the elevation of 10, 11,000 feet. But you know, we talked to a CSP officer, a trooper, just a, a little while ago, and we made a I, uh, stop to get some uh, fuel just a while ago. And I said, how are things out there on the roadway? He goes, so far, not too bad. But he did add this. He said, I'm worried about tonight, meaning when all this stuff and this moisture out here from some of the drizzling snow melts tonight, things could get slick and this could be a whole different story. But again, if you're heading up to the high country, heads up, winter-like driving conditions. Live along C-470, I'm Jim Hooley, Fox 31.